Oh. Believe me, I know him very well. But he's generous if you work for him. Uh, and I was in Oregon that one time. Was that, that was years ago. He's paying me nine, nine or nine twenty-five an hour mm -hmm. to do a little part-time work around the, on, his, on his back deck and stuff. He says you do not overfill the fuel. They yeah. have to have expansion room. Yeah. Always put it up. It's three, eighteen point five gallon U.S. Oh, okay. Oh, U.S. Eighteen. And it's well, about the same as on. Uh -huh. It's not the 17 Screw on, on filler cap and keep turning until it has kicked. It clicked at least three times. Oh, okay. Which I did. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we're going to run regular gas in it, like I said, until it starts to So there's an antifreeze for gasoline when it's freezing temps. Mm -hmm. We have to put half of that. Oh, it's not even. It was 30 freezer. last night. 30. It just oh, required so self condensation. It's got to be really, I mean, minus zero or something, down to zero or something like Alaska or the Arctic. Before you really need something. They say like we that. use gasoline that contains detergents and corrosion inhibitors because, mm -hmm. uh huh. 